Treatment of cancer generally includes radiation therapy in which beams of intense energy are used to kill cancer cells. Doctors use radiation therapy to treat just about every type of cancer. But giving focused radiation doses in the upper abdomen and thoracic region poses a huge problem due to the movement associated with breathing. Although state-of-the-art motion management techniques such as gating and tracking have also arrived, 100% focus radiation is still not possible using these techniques. For radiation to be customized for a particular patient, their exact lung movement has to be simulated and then delivery of the radiation with minimal dosage can be achieved. Before the radiation therapy is done on a human, its effectiveness needs to be checked on a robotic phantom. Now, researchers from the Indian Institute of Technology, Kanpur, in collaboration with scientists from the Sanjay Gandhi Postgraduate Institute of Medical Sciences, SPGIMS, Lucknow, have developed a new and inexpensive 3D robotic motion phantom that can move like a human lung. This robotic phantom will be helpful in delivering focus radiation to the patients. Developed with the help of DST's Advanced Manufacturing Technologies program, this technology is currently under final testing as part of Make in India. This indigenous technology will very soon enable doctors to use concentrated radiation, dose quantification and more accurately assess its effects. So what the robotic phantom will do, it, it has three degrees of freedom and the way the tumor moves up and down and also inside, it also moves in 3D. So basically it is three dimensional motion. So that uh, robotic arm will also move the tumor like this. And then we are going to place many sensors on this uh, device and then we are going to focus the radiation. So as it is moving, the radiation is also moving with this tumor. And so we are radiating only two centimeters. So uh, what was happening before is we were killing say about 10 centimeter tissue along with this. So we will uh, kill only 2 cm and we are going to save that 8 cm. The bulk of the Phantom is a dynamic platform over which image quality assurance devices can be placed and the platform can mimic 3D tumor motion by using three independent stepper motor systems. This platform is placed on the bed where the patient lies during radiation therapy. As the phantom emulates the lung movement, a moving or gatting window is used to focus the radiation from the radiation machine on the moving tumor. Detectors placed in the phantom help detect whether the radiation is localized on the tumor. This results in minimal radiation exposure to both the patient and the medical staff and provides high quality images of continuous advanced 4D radiation therapy treatments. After examining the radiation therapy on this robotic phantom, the same process is adopted on patients. This phantom could be used as a quality assurance phantom to verify the lung motion. So in order to deliver high-end radiotherapy like SBRT using the modern linear accelerator or cyber knife equipments, before that we would like to use this phantom to generate the patient specific lung motion and put a dosimeter on this and verify the doses acquired by the patient before the patient is being actually treated. This is the first time that this type of robotic phantom has been manufactured in India. More importantly, it is more affordable than other imported products available in the market. This robotic phantom can be used to create different types of lung movements. The research team is now looking to commercialize their 3D robotic motion phantom so that this indigenous solution can be made available to the Indian market soon.